Hi, I am Suraj Bharti and you know the most common question among beginner guitar players is that how to shift chords uh, while you're playing a song or uh, how to shift chord in its exact timing. So uh, let's say that you're a beginner guitar player, uh, you're a beginner uh, and you, I think you must have learned some basic chords like A major, G major, uh, C, A minor, D, etc. Uh, these are some open position chords, you know. Uh, I think you know that. Uh, but the big issue comes uh, is that you don't know how to shift from one chord to another, like this. Yeah, so you don't know how to shift between these chords in its exact timing. So let me tell you what exactly what you're doing is let's take A major chord, that's very easy chord. Uh, then you have to shift to D. So you'll strum in A chord. Now you have to shift to D actually. <laughs> But while shifting, you'll find where is your D chord. And time is gone. So, in this situation, what you have to do is don't think about strumming at, if you are in this stage. So, what exactly you have to do, play it very slow. Just do down strums, four down strums. Then shift to D. Don't think about your right hand technique if you are in this stage. Okay? Just think about how to shift from this. From this to this. From A major to D major. Just focus on that only. And play it very slowly. Very slowly. Okay? Just four beats. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. You can tap your feet. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And many people tell you to use metronome for this practice, but I personally don't think it's a good good idea. Uh, because if you're using metronome in this stage, uh, you're thinking too much in your head. No, if you are comfortable in shifting chords first, then you can use metronome or you can some strumming patterns like. But, but first, what you have to do is to just do four down strums in A then in D and play it very slowly at first two three four one two three four do this for a week or a month And after that, you can gradually increase your tempo. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four. If you are comfortable in doing this, then you can start using some strumming patterns. And when you're doing in A major and D major, you can now change to other chords also. Uh, it's C, C major. Two, three, 
four, now G. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So if this lesson helped you, please go like this video and subscribe to my channel and share with your friends who are just beginning in guitar. Thank you.